that came about um, during a pilot season when I was reading some scripts, and I was lucky enough to read that one, and I loved it. And um, then I was told to go meet Carter Bays and Craig Thomas at a Starbucks in Brentwood. And I went over to that Starbucks, and every table had two young guys. That's what I remember. And I'm like, are you Carter and Craig? Are you Carter and Craig? And I finally found them, and I fell in love with them. And uh, I just, they were, they were teenagers. My God, they were so young. Um, but they wrote a great script, and we had a really great time shooting that pilot. It was a really different. It was a really different kind of pilot. How did they describe the show to you at that meeting? Um, I think they let the the script, uh, you know, describe it for them. Um, you know, a love story in reverse, and and all of that. And then we talked about, you know, the sort of, you know, the. I wouldn't say the Bob Saget of it all because he hadn't been cast yet as the as the narrator, um, but we certainly knew what they were going for, and um, you initially think, you know, oh, great, it's another audience show, but then we re soon realized that that was an impossible thing, and so we did the pilot without an audience, um, thinking that if it got picked up, it would become an audience show, which it never did. So. Um what appealed to you about the show? Why did you jump at the chance to do it? Romance. Not only funny, but just, there were just so many big moments in that pilot. Um, it was just sort of cinematic, and it was, it was everything. It was everything that I loved, going back to what I loved about soaps, what I loved about sitcoms. It was sort of the best of everything to me. Um, and not shooting the pilot with an audience was an interesting idea, but it turned out it was 80 scenes or something crazy like that, and there were no family members that loved us enough to sit still for that amount of time. So we ended up needing four days to shoot it, which is a, a long time for a, um, a multicam. Um, and it was, in fact, a multicam and a single cam, so it was sort of whatever it needed to be. Um, and it just worked. We all, we just, we were old friends instantly. Um, but I didn't think it would get picked up because it was so great. <laughs> because, because when you have that good of a time, there's no way they're going to let you do it again.